Alright, you're welcome to this tutorial. Um, today I'll be teaching you how to use your smartphone to create cartoon of yourself or for someone. Just a cartoon image. How to turn your, your images and your photos into cartoon. Alright, so today, as you can see on the screen, I have two apps um, right here, and I'll be teaching you how on how to use these apps to create cartoon um, of yourself or for someone, and also. You can decide to, um, to download the two apps or decide to download one. So very quickly, I would like us to go firstly to the Photo Lab app, and then you engage the features to see how it works. Alright, so I just clicked on the Photo Lab. Alright, so this is the first thing that pops up. Alright, so you can see there are many features here to use. There are many features here to use. I want it to load faster using them. There are a lot of features, as in a lot of features. And mind you, in this app, they will give you a lot of options to download the Pro. But please don't download the Pro, it's not necessary. You can use the free app. The free apps also are great, they are good. You can use them. You don't have to download the Pro to use them. Then, alright, you have just Alright, so these are the features. There are a lot of features in this um in this app. So very quickly, I just like us to click on just one and use any of it. Or you can use any of it to create. Or you can decide to if you if you use this lady with this one now. If you have your uh, if your hair is in, if if you have your hair in your picture, you change to this color also. It will look exactly if it's this fire, it will have fire around it and all. But this for this fire one is for pro. It's for the pro. Alright. So anyone you want, you can decide to choose. Alright, so let me say I want um let me choose one. Still loading. Let me see. Let me choose this um, baby one. Alright, I just clicked on it. Can click on any one, like the one that the cloth is showing and um, this thing. If you use it, your cloth also will change. Alright, your cloth also will change. So let me click on my gallery to put the gallery I want to use, the image I want to use. Alright, so it's already there. Alright, so this is the image I want to use. You can decide to use everything, or you can decide to change the dimensions. Or you can decide to change the dimensions. Let me just say, let me use this one. Alright, this one square dimension. I like it for the pictures. Alright, so this one, I'll go to next. It's just add. Wait for it to load. I'll just add a lot of ads in this app to so erase for its processing now. As you can see, it's processing and it's almost done. Right, it's almost done. Right. Impress. So here is it. You can see how beautiful and now cartoon like my my image has turned to like a magic all right so this is it and you can decide to add more effects to your um to your picture like this by clicking this plus option here. this plus icon you can decide to animate it put like love anything on it and then to add art effects and animation means to make it anything that will, that will be moving in the picture but mind you, if you try to animate it or you put something like love, like I said, you put something like love or anything, the photo lab and um, watermark will show there. You have to take it down to any shot to remove the photo mark or the, the photo, um, the photo, the watermark, um, sorry, the watermark, this thing, the watermark effect. You have to take it down to any shot. And if you can't take it down to any shot to remove the watermark, you can do a screen record of it. As, as, as the 
um, the icon or the object is moving on the on your picture um, it will it will be like that all right so you can decide to use your screen recorder you can decide to save it after you animate it and then take it down to your InShot app to remove it. Let me try something so you understand what I'm saying. But just that it takes time. Look at this for example. If I click on it, it will take time to load. That's why I don't want to. If you click on it, this plus icon will this um love will be showing just like it's showing here, like this. Or if it's this shiny stuff, it will be showing. Alright, so that is what I'm talking about. But if you save it on this play on this part, it won't it won't save normally to save with watermarks of photo lab all right so you have to take it down to InShot to remove the watermark and if you take it down to InShot, it will no longer move anymore as in the love or anything that is moving on the um, on your picture won't move all right that is preferable you do a screen record of it as it's moving and then you crop it crop the other part you don't want i mean the up part of your screen and then make it look like just the way it is like this so anyhow you want it, that's it. So let me just write a test. I have my design app. I can decide to write my test, but and just add the effect here. Alright. So that is that about that, and then you um, you save to your device. Click on these three dots here. You save. You can decide to share to WhatsApp, share immediately, anyhow you want it to be done. You can decide to share also to Photo Lab. Other people will see. They will see it once they click on it. Alright. You can decide to share to WhatsApp, to Facebook, Telegram, all like that. Alright. So I can decide to copy out. I can copy out. Copy it out here. Sorry, try to copy it out here. All right, so you click on this to save the device. So download. All right, as you can see, it's. Uh, all right, you can see it um, already downloaded. Let me go to my gallery to see it. Alright, so this is it for my gallery. But you can see that the photo lab um watermark is there, which is not supposed to be. Alright, so what I'll just tell you to do if you don't want to um, download it and you don't want the photo lab to be shown there because it's not good at all for that to do. You just you just screenshot it. Alright, you just do a screenshot of it. And see it's exactly and perfect all right it's the same thing and then you do the uh, normal editing you crop it out like that and then i would like to see your animation i would like to see your video and um, your cartoon image all right do it this way and to be best for it just screenshot all right so now the next app um, i will be looking at now is the boiler all right the boiler This one also is best for 3D cartoon um, creation, right? See? It's best for 3D cartoon animation. You can decide to do any kind of animation you want to do with it. Trust me, you will really love it. You will really love it. This is 2D. I like to do 2D for it. It's, and anyhow you want it, cartoons, caricature. 200 2000 s pop star there are many things you can do with it yeah, there are many things you can do with it so let's say i want to do this one make sure it's big let's say i want to do 3d cartoon let me say beauty painting right?
and you take the same image I'm also telling you to upgrade to Pro, it's not necessary, just wait for you to process and finish, then you use the free um, version. Alright, so this is 2D, I changed to 2D, alright, so this is it, you can see different layout, yours might, might be more better, more awesome, more okay, it is, this cartoon 2D, right, so you can see different you have to do everything like this one, two. and then anyone you want out of it you go down here to uh, to download it once, you, once it's downloaded to be saved to your gallery and if you want to do a little adjustment just come here and add saturation to it any how you want it or reduce it right or any how you want it to be done contrast temperature sharpen it sharpen it we'll start sharpen the edge so it will be sharpened then I want it to be sharpened and decide to do it that way and then okay, sorry that's a mistake I did two D just now let me go back to the one I did before let me say beauty painting it's just the same thing I've been doing alright Click on image. Alright, so this is beauty painting, and there are four. There are three others you can change yourself to here. This is the first one, second one, third one. I think I forget this first one. So once you, are, once you want to try to adjust again, alright. Brightness, reduce the brightness. Now the contrast. Alright, you can see. It's getting better. You can also decide to sharpen it. I've been sharpening the edge and sharpening the body, everything. Right. As you see, it's, it's very better now. And then you save as normal. So once you don't change to pro just continue using it like this then you want you save it so water has been saved and this is how it's gonna be on your gallery but if you don't want the and uh, the watermark to show also to show right. console you can also save it this is like this this way also save it like this way. There are three ways you can save it. You can save it one. Like this will show like this two or like this three. And if you don't want it to show, you have to go back and then screenshot again. Alright, so once it's screenshotted, it will be on your gallery. So that's that about that. I hope to see your cartoon images on the group all right thank you for watching goodbye for now